Today's gonna be a video about why I'm moving into this van. <laughs> I'm kinda sick too, so you gotta bear with me here a little bit. We're outie, we are out of here. I'm gonna record this video and it's gonna be good. a little bit about myself. My name's Dustin Zaff. I'm 28 years old. Just turned 28 years old, so don't get too carried away. I've been working the same job for six years. I'm kind of over it, which is why I quit last Friday. So I haven't been working for a week, and I've always been kind of driven to travel, and I just so happened to get this sweet van. It was my grandpa's I've been fixing it up for the last 10 years and now is a time in my life where I don't have much timey down. I'm just kind of ready. I'm ready to travel. And I'm going to all 50 states, all 50 capitals, state capitals, national parks, everything. Canada, Mexico, I'm freaking going and I'm doing it. I'm leaving the beginning of January. So I have about two months, which is honestly too long because I can't stand the cold. Kinda got this little stuffy nose thing going on. I think it's lack of sun. It's something. Like I don't go outside when it's winter time and I just feel like I can't like live because most of the things I do are outdoors and when you're cooped up inside, you can't do them things. So the whole process is getting documented right here on this channel. So if you wanna see this, if this is interesting, stick around, more's coming up. Since I'm doing all this, that means I have to live in this van. No bathroom, I have no running water. I do have power, thanks to the sun. I got solar panels and I'll be able to charge basic stuff in order to make these videos. I don't have internet access, so I'm gonna have to rob internet from coffee shops and places like that. So I'm gonna have to, I'm gonna have to really figure that out. Maybe get internet myself and upload through that. But this whole thing is getting, documented right here. So this is gonna be my new home here soon. I'm gonna move in here in, a, in two months. It's November, it's the beginning of November now, November 8th, and in the beginning of January, after the holidays, after Thanksgiving, after New Year's, I'm gonna move in and travel this country in this thing, and all right, I'm gonna show you guys the inside. So this is the door handle. And I'm gonna shut the door real quick because it's freaking cold outside, which is why I got my hood up. So this is my little mini fridge right here. It's an angle and I made some drawer sliders in order for this to slide out and then you can open it and that's where the food's gonna go. You can push back in. I got this counter off Amazon. It's actually a cutting board. I got silverware down there. So if you need to eat something, there's a spoon, there's another spoon. So I have a table where I can eat. And notice I have two spoons in case I ever get a date and we can have the silverware that we need to eat. So that's good. Can you see? Okay, so basically, there's a latch back here, pull that, and this, you pull. And it folds into a lovely bed that you can sleep on. I got a curtain that I can close and sleep in privacy. So that's good, I got a bed that I can sleep in at least, and a roof over my head. But there's my sleeping bag actually, I'm ready. I'm ready right now. It's getting cold up here and I'm ready to go south, but I have to wait until the holidays are over. So that's kind of a dilemma. I got my solar uh, little readout thing right here, which you can't see because of the back glare, but my battery's like fully charged. There you go, 14.1. I got a half an amp going in. So that's good, it's working. And I'm gonna pull this bed up real quick. All right, you gotta pull this this up and then this folds back into a couch back in hangout mode 
table. So this is where I'm gonna edit all my videos and I'm gonna hang out most of the time because, I mean, look at it. This is home. I got power right here, a 12 volt socket, I got USB for my phone, cup holder, you can see the lovely outdoors. I also got curtains here, curtains here, I got a light, just in case it gets too dark. For that camera mount, I'll be able to mount my camera out there when I'm like recording, kind of like right now. It'd be nice to put it right there and it'd be nice and still. Okay, there's my little camera uh, stabilizer that I made. The camera goes on top, then wires avoid the bumps because it springs and allows it to like kind of collapse and it absorbs bumps, which is freaking sweet. So that's pretty much the inside of my van. There's really not much in here. It's very small and I don't have room to put a lot of things in here. So I'm gonna have to be very organized and not have much things, many things. So that's that. We'll go on the outside and check that out, but we're gonna make it quick cause it's cold. The great outdoors. So the great outdoors is where I'm gonna be living and showering. I'm gonna shower at, I guess a gym maybe, or as long as it's warm enough at random like lakes, rivers, creeks, oceans, all the above. So this is the outside of my van and I have newer wheels on it. R32 wheels with Brembo four piston calipers on the front. And I got GTI calipers on the rear. So I can stop good with my Subaru transmission and engine since I'm gonna be going like faster and more weight because I'm living here. This is my bike rack that I have. And this bike rack, if you hit this whole switch, this whole thing pivots and it allows the bike to be leaned at an angle. And it's at an angle. So when it's open right here, the bike can lean over and it'll miss the hatch. So I can actually open my van uh, hatch now if I need to work on my engine. This thing will also pivot. I got a bolt there, a hinge there that I made, and I got a spring, actually a shock, that will, will push this out. Spare tire, ladder rack that I made. I have two Renogy 100 watt solar panels that I hooked up. Actually on my way here, this is my water tank. And this water tank was actually, it was making a bunch of noise on the way here. Here, I'll show you. You guys hear that? So that is frozen water. And the water froze in there, obviously, cause it's cold outside. But when I was driving, I kept hearing that. And I thought something was rolling around on the outside of my van. Like I left something on the roof or my bumper and it was like tumbling and I got kind of nervous. So I pulled over and it was just water frozen in my tank, which is where I'm gonna shower actually. So that's probably really cold right now, but that's where I'm gonna wash my head cause I get nasty after a while. Um, oh yeah, my storage over, over here. That's where I'm gonna put all my clothes, all my, what else do you need? All my clothes, all my, there's a couple bags in there. I'm gonna open that up and show you guys. So I just opened this up and on the inside, I got bags. But yeah, I got four of them and they're pretty good size. They're almost as big as a table for reference. But I got four of them things in there. And well, I only got three now, but I got one at the house. So this is where my clothes are gonna go and I'll be able to pack all my stuff in there all my like cooking stuff, clothes, uh, what else do you need? So that's where all my stuff's gonna go. I wanna put this back up there. Yeah, that's where my crap goes. So I don't know what else to show you guys. So that van right there is my new home. <laughs> yeah!